Several provinces across Laos, including Vientiane, Long Prabang, Savannakhet, and Jampasak, began their Lao New Year celebrations with a Mispi Mai Lao procession, while the water wars were everywhere. It is widely observed that Bunbi Mai Lao this year generally celebrated in a spirit of revelry and friendship. Many streets in Laos were drenched with water as Lao people joined with foreign tourists to throw water at passers-by and generally celebrate the new year in a spirit of revelry and friendship. Luang Prabang, Phang Ngum Road in Vientian, Wang Vieng Song River in Vientian Province, and Pak Se were among the most popular destinations for foreign visitors and local residents as well. A particular highlight was the beautiful Nang Sang Khan procession in Luang Prabang, which included parades of monks and people dressed in the traditional clothing of the different ethnic groups. On Sunday, Vieng Chan joined with the provinces of Luang Prabang, Bo Gao, Siang Kuang, Sawanaket, Salawan, Jampasak, and Kamuan to hold Miss Lao New Year processions to add color to the celebrations. Meanwhile, music thundered from loudspeakers throughout Vieng Chan as roadside parties got into full swing in every corner of the capital. Friends and passers-by alike mingled joyously as if they had known each other forever. Many people also loaded water tanks onto pickup trucks to throw water on people along the roads as well as at other pickup trucks passing by. However, it was unavoidable that some teenagers behaved inappropriately by throwing water bags and colored water on people in their jubilation. This kind of behavior can cause motorists to have road accidents and needs to be avoided. The festive atmosphere abated somewhat as Lao traditions took precedence. Many people tried to celebrate the new year based on traditional culture, taking this opportunity to hold Basi ceremonies with their families and pour water to ask for forgiveness from their elders and their parents. People visited temples to pour water on Buddha images and ask for good luck in the year to come. With people seeking the Buddha which corresponded to the day they were born, monks were hand on to tie white strings around people's hands as a way to wish them good health and good fortune after the new year and throughout the rest of their lives. A special Basi ceremony was held at Vat Ung Tư Temple in central Vientiane to encourage residents to be peaceful as well as ask for blessings and forgiveness among the participants. After New Year's Day, Buddha images were taken back to their residing places and in some temples they held Basi ceremonies for the monks. This year, the government announced April 17th as a public holiday to compensate for April 14th, the first day of the New Year, which fell on a Sunday. The extra holiday gave a chance for people to visit their relatives in different provinces. People started coming back to Vientiane from the provinces on Tuesday and Wednesday to be back at work on April 18. Not only Laos celebrates this kind of New Year festival, Theravada Buddhist countries including Sri Lanka, Thailand, Cambodia and Myanmar also take part in water splashing ceremonies to symbolize a clean start to the new year. Hey, hey, hey.